It's the weasel. Hello, fellow fellows, and welcome to Fan Scene. And today I have for you my Thanksgiving guilty pleasure movie, Son in Law. That's right, I can hear you out there. Are you serious, Son in Law? Uh, yes, Son in Law. It's a guilty pleasure of mine that stars Polly Shore, Lane Smith, Carlo Gugina, uh, which I'm just know I mispronounced her name just now, and also Tiffany Amber uh, Thiessen, Kelly Kapowski. Uh, yes, I know this movie is a take it or leave it type movie. I know a lot of people. Hate on it, but also a lot of people like it. It's just one of them weird things, uh, kind of like an Adam Sandler movie. <laughs> um, and it's probably short. But listen, guys, not every movie needs to be uh, award-winning uh, <laughs> Oscar acting. You know, sometimes you just want to watch a movie, laugh, e even at the you know some bad storytelling or generic storytelling. Uh, it's just a simple plot and a simple comedy. And, you know, in the times like these, sometimes it's just good to have that. So, I, I like this movie. I tend to watch it uh, on Thanksgiving uh, here and there. And it's just a good, good funny flick. Even even in the bad parts, you can even laugh at the parts where it's, uh, you know, not where, you, where it's supposed to be funny, but it's not funny. But anyways, the story centers on uh, Rebecca, who is from South Dakota, who's a country girl. Uh, she's going to college in California. Uh, she... You know, her family takes her there. She finds out her roommate's a lesbian. Uh, she lives next door to the resident advisor, Polly Shore Crawl. And she's just not fitting in. She doesn't like it. She wants to go home. And then Polly Shore's character, Crawl, uh, he takes her under his wing. He helps her adjust to California living. <laughs> and, uh, you know, they become really good friends. And then it approaches Thanksgiving, uh, the break to go home. And uh, Rebecca, Becca, as Crawl calls her, doesn't really want to... Uh, marry her high school boyfriend you know uh she's just kind of grown outgrown that and you know so she decides to take uh crawl home with her and to south dakota with her very like conservative <laughs> farm going family and uh you know he it, this is where like the roles kind of reverse and he has to acclimate to uh the country living and he brings his style and his flair it's probably sure oh buddies you know that crazy that craziness <laughs> I know, take it or leave it. And, you know, he like, turns their family upside down. He helps uh, Becca's mom become uh, like Becca, you know, hot. And, you know, he starts to make friends with her dad and her grandpa and, uh, you know, her little brother uh, who from, who's from the Big Green, uh, Chubby Cheekies. So, yeah, it's pretty funny. and I like it. I, I like it. You know, it gets pretty funny. Um, I like the interaction between people. There's some good moments, uh, at the, <laughs> you know, uh, and if I'm honest here, you know, uh, with Tiffany Amber Th Thiessen, who is in this movie, she does a, sort of a strip tease for his bachelor party in this because, uh, you know, he pretends to, to say that he proposed to Becca so that she doesn't have to marry her uh, high school boyfriend. And, you know, that causes all kinds of trouble. But Tiffany Amber Thiessen does this, uh, like, strip tease. And as somebody who is a fan of Say by the Bell... And Kelly Kapowski was like that girl next door, the hot chick. To see her sort of dance like that, I mean, just, I mean, I've got it playing right here, and you, you can see it. And uh, uh, you know, as a kid uh, who is now old enough to, you know, as somebody who is, uh, you know, old enough to understand now. And I mean, as you can see right here, I mean, uh, that's to me that scene is worth. Let alone is worth. Uh, the admission to this movie, <laughs> but that's not, I'm, I, that's my maleness coming out, I apologize to any females who may watch this, uh, but yeah, I, that's what another reason I like it, but that's not the whole reason I like it, I like the family story, I like the dynamic, and, and like, with everything going on in the world today, it's like, California and the country girl, and these two worlds collide, and they get along, they get along, they, they go through their differences, and they become friends, and it has a happy ending, and it's Thanksgiving, and it's something you can watch with your family. And, uh, I mean, I know some people don't like Polly Shore, uh, but just give it a chance. You may like it. I find it funny. Um, if you're looking for something to watch this Thanksgiving, try Son-in-Law. If you don't like it, I understand. I get where you're coming from. It's a take-it-or-leave-it type movie. But if you're looking for something for Thanksgiving, 
you can't go wrong with, uh, well, I guess some of you could go wrong with it. If you like this video, please give it a like. If you did not like this video, you can go ahead and give it a dislike. That is all up to you guys. No hurt feelings here. Uh, please. I know son and all. <laughs> uh, share the video out for everybody to see. Uh, please subscribe and hit that bell for notifications. I would truly appreciate that. I thank you for watching. Wherever you are, have a great, safe, happy, healthy day, morning, afternoon, evening, and night. Godspeed and happy Thanksgiving.